there's the 80 20 rule of wealth which is like 20 percent of it is mechanics and the other 80 percent is mindset so my job as your finance geek as your financial coach as your financial consultant hopefully down the line a friend um, hopefully down the line a business partner my job is the 20 percent mechanics it's to help solve the mechanics the principles the numbers the rules but you have to come with this i cannot give you this mindset i cannot it's impossible for me to give you mindset a wealth mindset it's something that must be heard right through a word once it is heard through a word then your mind after it's heard it so many times it then goes into your soul which is your mind will and emotions once it goes to to your conscious mind and then it goes to the subconscious mind once it lands there it is now in your hard drive it is now completely downloaded and now you have a wealth mindset that might take a long time or it could be a short time it really boils down to your ability to surrender right here's another rule this is a principle i surrender i surrender to what i think i know about money i surrender it i'm like whatever i think i know about money i throw it out the door and i look at something completely objectively how can this benefit my life okay and i look at the pros I look at the cons. Do the pros outweigh the cons? Is it ethical? Is it moral? How, uh, what is the track record of it? 100 years, 300 years, 1,000 years. Okay, the, the longer the track record, obviously, the better, the more likely it is I'll have success with it, as long as I follow the rules. So that's another rule for me is I surrender. The faster I'm able to surrender, the quicker I am to change my mindset about a thing, right?